well, it's a great weekend for New Zealand yeah. this weekend. The uh, the Wellington Phoenix got a well, they rained on Archie's parade. They uh, they they beat the Melbourne Victory three two away from home. There was also a pretty big cricket match over in New Zealand on the weekend. Victory to the Kiwis yep. over the Aussies. So we thought we'd check in with our good friends from across the ditch to see what's been happening over there from Kiwi TV. Jim Phillips and Terry Chris. <laughs> Slightly overboard, my friends. Oh, oh, here oh, we go. Well, it's possibly the greatest weekend in Kiwi Australian competition. Oh, no <laughs> question. The Aussies came to Eden Park yeah. and they copped a wallop on. What a win! <laughs> and in the most difficult of conditions. I do not know how they did it. Sorry, what? What difficult conditions? Fib fast. Our boys. <laughs> our boys could hardly fit straight. Oh, how did they do it? How did they do oh, it? What? What about the Phoenix? Oh my lord, a crushing 3 2 victory! <laughs> that was a shellacking! A shellacking! <laughs> That's not a shellacking. Oh, see, I see it is over here, more it's a shellacking! More glitter, please! More glitter! <laughs> I tell you what, you two, it is back to the drawing board for the victory if you call them that. Hey, even your Prime Minister copped a hiding! Oh, oh, what? Oh, oh, oh. Prime, he, was, he was there to meet your Prime Minister, John Key. Yeah, they went for a jog before breakfast. Yeah. Guess who got to the buffet first? <laughs> <laughs> was halfway through his bagel before Tony Abbott handed over his breakfast bag. Another victory! <laughs> I, I, I must say, boys, you did play particularly well. Actually, particularly Brendan McCallum. Oh, careful, oh, look, oh. careful. You'll start the glitter again if you mention his name. <laughs> In all seriousness. <laughs> <laughs> you, now, when you... Mm. about the greatest crocketer of all time. <laughs> Interesting point. Well, Bradman's place is clear. Absolutely. Right after McCullum. Excellent. <laughs> Number two. Highest gets, compliment. That's right. But then it gets tricky. Yes. Ward. Oh, Vittori. Oh, yeah, Vittori. Vittori. Yes. Vittori. Yes. What? <laughs> Three. <laughs> Glitter. <laughs> Vittori. 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 Yeah. Do you realise you actually haven't even won the World Cup yet? Oh, for God's oh. sake, why do we bother? Go back to your bloody dolls. <laughs> <laughs> why would we want to do that? That's the one we were after. We clutched it. The all-important round robin, sorry. The group page. <laughs> Bring on the street parade. Oh, no. What? I've just had a thought. What is it? When we win again, what are we going to do for Glotter? Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. We've got a minute left. Keep going. I think we're going to have to leave it there. <laughs> Troops. We need glitter over here. Where's the spirit send us, uh, send us some glitter. I think we're done. Are we? Oh, yeah. Oh, that's interesting. Our interview goes 45 minutes less than the doll segment. <laughs> right, I tell you what, as soon as that tall, handsome bloke leaves, it all turns to shut. <laughs> Please thank Tim and Terry from Kiwi TV. <laughs> This has been a production of Fox Sports.